Hey, and welcome back to the channel. If you've recently installed Unmindable Miner on a Windows 10 PC, you may have noticed that it only supports XM Rig. XM Rig is a type of miner that is used. There's many of them out there, Phoenix Miner, LOL Miner. There's quite a few different miners that are available, but for Unmindable Miner on a Windows 10 PC, right now it is only supporting XM Rig. So if you don't have this, you might be getting an error and not being able to continue with your installation. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to download it and add it to Unmindable Miner. So we're gonna begin at our unmineable folder. We already have it extracted and it's in our mining folder. It's already been excluded by Windows Threat Protection. If you haven't done that, you can check out this video on how to do that. We also have a link in the description. So it should run with no problems because it's been excluded. We've just double clicked on it to execute it and it's gonna open up right now. Okay, so here we are at the beginning of the window where we click on continue. And now you either select a CPU or a GPU. I'm gonna select CPU. And right over here, it has the minor file location. Now, by default, the XM rig should have already downloaded. Now, if you're downloading a beta version or an older version and you require the XM rig, what you can do is you can just click on the XM rig link that's right here. And it'll take you to the GitHub website. If you do not have the link, I'll include this GitHub link in the description below. And what you can do is you just scroll down a bit here and we're going to be looking for the Windows 64-bit version. I'm running a 64-bit version of Windows, so I have to make sure I download the right one. And if you look for the list, here it is. So this is the one that we want to click on and download. 6.12.2 is the version that we have here. That's the latest one as of today, June 24th, 2021. And here it is. So this is the folder where we've downloaded it. And here's all the files, including the XM rig executable file. So I'm gonna just close out of this and I wanna make sure I drag and drop it into my mining folder because everything in here has been excluded in the Windows threat protection. So we won't get any warnings. So no warning props will happen in here. And if I just double check on it, there it is, okay. So here's a folder and this, this is the path that we're gonna be looking for to make sure that we show the right location. So I'm just gonna to navigate to my desktop folder and it's in my mining folder. And then there is the XM rig and then we can find the executable file. There it is. We select it and then click on open. And now you can click on next and it shouldn't give you any error messages. It should allow you to proceed. So let's click on next. And there we go. So now we can just select the token of our choice and put in the address and then we can continue and begin mining. So in this example, I'll just quickly select one. I'll type in Doge, and then I have to enter my address. So let me just go to my wallet and get my Doge address. Okay, and I'll just paste it in there. And then um, you can either click on start, but if you wanna save money, probably best to use a referral code. So let me just get a referral code and quickly enter that in. Full codes save you about quarter percent. That's just more money in your pocket. Click on start and it should begin mining. There we go. So the miner has begun. We'll get a hash rate in just a few moments here and we can continue. Okay, and there we go. So the miner has begun. It'll start, uh, that hash rate 0.2 is pretty low, but that'll increase over time. The links will be in the description below so you can get the XM rig file download it to your PC and then add it to a mineable miner. And anything else that you require for this installation to work properly, I'll make sure I put all the links in the description. So if you have any questions, you can go ahead and put them in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.